This must be it. Looks pretty ancient, but I recognize Renan architecture when I see it. It's seen some beatings. If it stayed sealed all this time, it's not because people left it alone. It's not just their technology. The Renans build their structures out of special materials, too. Strong enough to withstand assaults from Danon tools and weaponry, anyway. So, how the hell are we... Easy. that I can see what's on the... Looks like this place used to be a supply base of some sort. It probably even dates back to the Great Conquest of three centuries ago. For an abandoned place, sure is crawling with critters. Kinda makes you wonder how they all got in. Through cracks in the walls, I guess. Maybe it's a good environment for these species to propagate in. Best not to let your guard down either way. Agreed. I don't know about you, but I'm not looking to hang around here any longer than necessary. Phew. <laughs> that may not have been a fancy feast we just had, but I don't remember the last time I felt this full. Do the Renans often not give you all enough to eat? It's never enough. The Renans decide exactly how much we'll have and when we'll have it, and that's that. We do our best to get around it. Everyone has to grow their own food and such behind the Renan's backs in order to get by. Thinking about it now, I wonder if they've always kept it meager so we would never have the energy to try to resist what they've done to us. Yeah. An empty stomach takes its toll on the body and the spirit after a while. How does a Renan like you know what it's like? I may be Renan, but they don't like me either. I could be squeaky clean and they still wouldn't give me anything. Your stomach just... I didn't hear anything. But you just ate. How are you already... I said I didn't hear anything. <sighs> I still have some I haven't eaten yet. Do you want it? Sure. This could be useful. of some sort? A Renan kind, yeah. We should definitely hold on to what's inside.
Our work is done here. Let's move. I'm right behind you, Xion. We've been walking around for a while now. Can we give up already? What, you're tired? I'm tired of something, all right. I'm not giving up until we search every inch of this place. She's really determined to find those clothes. Together, that wasn't even a problem. Is this Renin technology? I'm amazed you guys can pull something like this off. For us, sites like this are completely normal. This must be... The former owner's old wardrobe, yeah. I wonder how long they've hung here. They don't look like they've aged a day. The designs are a little dated, but... It'll have to do. Listen, I get it. You care how you look. But we've got places to...
What is it? N no. I... Uh, nothing. We've kept Zephyr and the others waiting long enough. We should head back. Okay. Let's head back to Ulzebeck. You're in a good mood. Were you that happy to find a new outfit? I don't know what you're talking about. I'm the same as ever. You said before that this probably used to be a supply depot, right? But Nay thought it was a Renan castle. I wonder what it actually is. Who knows? Who knows? What, can't I not know something? You didn't think I knew every last thing about my own kind, did you? I didn't say that. <sighs> from what I've heard, a lot of the materials that were initially brought over from Rena 300 years ago were repurposed for other things over time. So it's entirely possible that this place used to be both a supply depot and a lord's castle at different points in time. They're not mutually exclusive. I couldn't tell you when the lord's castle moved to its current location, though. Well, satisfied? Uh, yeah. Thank you. You know, for telling me about all that. Uh, it's not like I mentioned anything that useful. Come on, let's keep moving. Like it could be worth something. That wasn't even a problem. Want to get back to Ulzebeck? Yeah, we better. We don't have time to waste. Someone's in a hurry.
break through. Here I go. Rising Wyvern! I never miss! You're mine! You're mine! Mega I can't lay a finger on you. I prefer it that way. What about you? Just watch. Together, that wasn't even a problem. I wonder if something happened. Crap! Hmm? What? Where do you think you're going? You know where. Mosul. I don't need your permission. Right behind you, Shion. There are fewer soldiers stationed at the garrison than usual. I won't forgive you! I'm Rising Wyvern! Clear escape! Hear me! Flame of Fury! Strike! Who wants to die? Rising Wyvern! Let's keep our eyes on the prize.
Barely a blip on our radar. I'm the best I can be. Still striving to be on par with the Lord? You simply can't be too strong when battle is a part of your every day. What's this thing?
Let's keep our eyes on the prize. What's this thing? I'm surprised there are owls here, too. Yeah, there are more of them around than I thought. Are you all right? What about the others? Are those bastards still here? Iron Mask, take it easy. It's all right now. <laughs> Most were able to escape, and we've survived. Honestly, we got off lucky. It's often worse when a resistance group pops up. Lucky? You call people getting slaughtered like this lucky? This is how things go when you're a Danon slave. You're dead if you stand up to them. Keep your head down and do as you're told. At least then you have a chance to survive. You only have one life. That's why... I should wait for the right moment? Yes. So someone else dies instead while we live another day. Is that what you're saying, Doc? You're willing to risk everything on the chance that things will get better if we wait long enough. But what's the point of waiting if others have to die so that we can live? What do you think happens when someone tries to resist? It'd be one thing if the Rebel died and that was that. But it never ends with only one death. You've seen it for yourself. Everyone suffers for it. Knowing that, are you really going to tell me our waiting has no meaning? But that's... I understand not wanting to throw away the same lives we're trying to protect. That would be senseless. But if you wait too long, if you get too used to waiting, then eventually you lose the will to fight. I don't want that to happen to me. I've already met the Crimson Crows. People who risk their lives to fight the Renan's rule. 
People who know they might not live to see us win, but fight anyway to give those who come after a better chance. If my life is at risk either way, then I'd rather spend it fighting. So you've decided to take up the sword? Yes, but not just any sword. It's a sword that only I can wield, but one that's also too powerful to use on my own. I doubt those who fought the Renans in the past ever had something like this on their side. That's why I'm willing to bet everything I have on this sword. I know it might mean more people end up in danger, but... Okay. If that's how you feel, then forget what I said. It's clear your time has come, Iron Mask. Currently, you and that sword are the only things capable of driving the Renans back. It's because of you that we're still alive right now. If there's a way through this for all of us, then I'll put my trust in you to find it. Doc... Thank you. Now, remember what you said. And don't ever abandon that conviction of yours, all right? Right. I won't. You've grown so much since we first met. And you've met some good people, too. Maybe you have a chance after all.